Hi guys, we're going whale watching and dolphin. No that means I'll have to leave Lately I've been That's a whale Yeah Hey, are you excited? Mm -hmm. We're about we're first in line. Kind of sit right there. Okay, I need you to be careful, okay? Mm -hmm. it's far away. Time me, watch your step coming down our ramp. Uh the will be safe. I can go ahead and take your tickets down on the dock, right this way. Okay, go ahead, Isaac. You must be in charge if you're first. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, we want to go that way. Thank you. Right here. Perfect. And uh, we do want you wearing your mask when you're on the boat. It is a requirement for us to be out here and running, so please keep those on, and uh, that's about it. Uh, if you want anything on the snack bar, see the guys inside. That'll be on the harbor here shortly.
be slowing down here a little bit, guys. Right ahead of us, off to the uh, left side of this boat ahead of us, there's a whale that's going south here. We'll uh, be putting down the left side of the boat here, probably about 11 o'clock or so from the boat. If the front of the boat is 12 o'clock, the back of the boat is 6 o'clock, we'll use that <laughs> clock to pinpoint the whale for you. Uh, these coming up two or three times, then going down for four to five minutes on average. That is pretty much normal for these guys. So what we're going to be looking at here is a southbound migrating gray whale. Once we see them surface, I'll let you know more about them. It's here, Isaac. He's here. Ready? Am I ready? Yes, I'm ready. Are you ready? We're gonna do a little circle around here, guys. See if we can uh, relocate this guy. Uh, what you want to be looking out for is called a spout. When the whale goes to breathe, a little bit of water and moisture gets caught in the whale's blowholes. Looks like a little puff of steam coming up from the surface of the water. It's called the whale's spout. Uh, you might even see a piece of whale's back or tail come up. But there's a whale very close to this vicinity. We're, we're close to a whale. We just got to see if he wants to show himself.
just came up there. Like I said, we'll be turning the boat here, putting them on about our two o'clock or so once we get turned around. But we're pointing right at them right now. They're about 100 yards away. But uh, these are two northbound migrating gray whales heading back up to the Barry in the Chukchi Sea in Alaska where they feed during the summer months. They've already been down to the shallow water lagoons in Mexico and Baja where they get birth and also mate. And the gray whale's migration is the longest migration of any of the mammals, about a four or 5,000 mile journey. Each direction takes about two and a half to three and a half months to complete each way. And they usually swim at speeds of three or four miles an hour. Remember, these guys must breathe there at all times where they'll rest or sleep as they kind of slow their body down, slowing their heart rate down, still swimming across the surface, taking breaths of air. Now these gray whales are all baleen whales. Like I said earlier, we have two different groups or classes. Coming up there, two, two good sized whales there. Looks up here, Hi. appears to be fully grown whales just about, so probably females. Uh, females are larger than the males. And you can see the whales have a lot of dis, uh, different colors across their body. All that white stuff you see on their uh, body, that is scarring from barnacles that has once grown the whale and fallen off. That barnacle is very unique to the gray whale. It's not found on any other rocks or pilings or anything else out here in the ocean. It's only found on the gray whales. And then back behind the whales, two blowholes, you'll see a lot of yellow looking stuff. That is called whale lice, just a type of parasite that happens to be growing on the whale. With the yellow and the white, it appears gray from the distance. Pretty much the whale's body is dark brown or black in color. Get ready, we're gonna come right back up about one o'clock. You can just barely see underneath the surface there. If you have any glasses, it kind of cuts the glare. You're kind of glowing right underneath right the here, water. Right here, Isaac, see, see. in here up here when I'm driving. But uh, get close to the surface, right about one to two o'clock there. Both of them are gonna come up here side by side just about. A little information about the babies of the calves. When they're born, they're about 10 to 15 feet long. And they might weigh 1,000 or 1,500 pounds. Here they go, nice shot of the whales there, guys. When they're born, they're usually born in the shallow water lagoons in Mexico and Baja. They're born down there for several reasons. One is the water's warm and shallow and they're protected from any predators or anyone that might want to harm them. When they're born, there's always another whale standing by that gently raises underneath the calf, raising the calf to the surface for its first breath of air. After that, they're on their own for swimming. They'll stay with their mothers down there for the first few weeks of life, maybe a month or so or more, uh, nursing about 15 to 60 gallons of milk per day. They'll gain about that same number and weight per day in a short amount of time. They're strong enough and healthy enough to make the long journey back north with their mother. They'll stay with their mother for the first year or so of their life. After that, they believe they do separate and do not reunite later on in life. And the lifespan of the gray whale is about 65 to 70 years. About one o'clock there. Oh, tail flukes. Check that out. Whale's tail is called its flukes. Usually when they show their flukes like that, they're going on a deeper dive. Holding their breath a little bit longer. Maybe you get another one. Oh, almost. But, uh, you can see the whale got that breath of air. It's a, a bigger breath of air. So he really expanded his lungs, took a big breath. Just going to go down a little deeper there. Did you see that, Isaac? Did you see the whale, the Did spout? You Did you see the water go when it breathes? Take a deep breath and it goes down. You saw it? You feel better? <laughs> fun? Yeah. What did you see? Ha, ha, ha.